Hey guys, it's Sam here and today I am showing you how to cure being a vampire lord from the new Dawnguard DLC in Skyrim. Um, now it's the exact same way as curing vampirism or vampire, I'm not entirely sure, <laughs> by doing this small side quest, Rising at Dawn. Um, but some people may get confused, I myself was confused, like I thought it was a totally different process and I, at times I thought you couldn't get cured. But doing this simple small side uh, the simple small side quest will cure you no problem. Okay. Um, to begin this quest, all you have to do, I've started this part, so this is why I'm not showing you in the video. But all you have to do is go to any bar in any major city, talk to the bartender, and ask if they've heard any rumours lately. And as soon as they say that, as soon as you say that, should I say I apologise? Um, they will say, hey. This guy, Balion, has studied vampires. Um, they do not know you're a vampire. Then uh, that is just that is just the like the the standard response you get from bartenders if you ask about rumors. Um, if you are a vampire, however, you cannot be a level four vampire, um, and you will know if you're a level four vampire if you are being attacked by everyone and everything. <laughs> when you walk into a bar for a drink, you get stabbed in the face. That, that means you're a level 4 vampire. Um, but easily just feed, take some blood and then go into the bar, ask for rumours and they will tell you about Falion. Okay, so after that, the small side quest will start. Uh, where is it? Quest. Rising at dawn. Speak to Falion. So all you have to do is fast travel to this place here. Mortal. Mortal. And get on your horse, if you have a horse. If not, what? Why am I being attacked? Run! It's the Dawn Guard, run! We're not fighting the Dawn Guard because we are doing a video. So just raid, follow wherever the marker tells you to. He can be found just out in the borders of town or in about town. Usually at night time he is just about round about here. So ride over here till you find this man. There we go. Up and go speak to him. Hello! Yeah. Okay, blah blah blah. Uh, blah blah blah. This is not what we want. And uh, you can get asked about conjuration if you like. But I heard you're an expert in vampirism. I know many things. I have studied things. Blah blah. Blah data blah. I'm looking for a cure. So you just say that. And now he says you need a filled black soul gem and you will need to kill someone in order to fill that soul gem. I have one, just for the purposes of this video, but if you do not have one, um, he will offer to sell you one for roughly about 160 gold, I think, which is a steal. And then all you have to do is fill it either through killing a human or a bandit, um, using a soul trap, or a weapon with, infused with the enchantment for capturing souls. So I have one, I'll show you what it looks like. Mm, miscellaneous. Black soul gem. There we go, just that there, or the grand one or whatever. So you get that filled and immediately come back to talk to him. I have a filled black soul gem. Meet me at the summoning circle in the marsh of dawn. We shall banish the creature you have become. Okay, so after that, just take a short run over, over the swamp and meet him at dawn. Just follow, follow the marker, follow the marker. right to here and dawn is roughly around 4 to 5 I would say like AM so just wait um, we will wait 3 hours no 4 hours wait 4 hours please there we go and he should appear he he should appear oh Sarana you frightened me he should appear. Hello, hello, Falion. What time is it? It's getting late or early. Falion. What is this? Okay, on route. Hello. Okay, that may take some time, guys. Um, so I have to do is wait. And if he's not here for five, I will go crazy. 
That would go crazy. He lied to me. I can't believe he lied to me. <laughs> Who doesn't lie, guys? Um, it may take a day or two before he actually appears, but you can just wait. Um, wait, we'll wait another hour and see if he appears. Has he appeared? Hello! Hello, Falion! Oh, there we go, there he's there. He's fighting a mudcrab. Maybe we should help him out. Okay, check for these mud crabs just in case. And so that was what, 6 a.m. And he up he comes. And you go speak to him. Good, you're here. Let's get this over with as you desire. And just before we start this, guys, I will show you. I have the vampire servant site and whatnot. I did, ha I did have the vampire lord, I have just finished the, the Dawn Guard DLC. So after you say that to him, he will enchant shit about oblivion and ancestors and please. Lame. Eh, 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 cure me already. And that should be it. Oh, pardon me guys. And there we go, rising at dawn. And you are no longer a vampire or a vampire lord, hooray! And we only have the two powers, hooray! And that is it guys, that is your cure from being a vampire lord. And I know there are videos out there to show you how to cure being a vampire. However, some people like myself may have got confused between a vampire and a vampire lord. Um, but it's the exact same way, so I just thought I'd make this video in the hopes that I help the the small band of people that do not know how to cure being a vampire lord. And in case you think, what have I done now? And you have no saves previously, you can talk to Sarana and say, hey bitch, turn me to vampire now. Actually, no. And that is you guys, that is you done. You are a vampire lord free. You are a vampire lord free. And you can walk in the sun. Hooray! So I hope you enjoyed guys and found it helpful. And if you did, don't forget to like, leave a comment and subscribe for the next part. Not the next part, just any other shit that I do. I do lots of shit. <laughs> so, goodbye. See you later.